Alright guys, so you guys are going to have to apologize for the noise. As you can see, they're building houses outside. But, we're still going to record. Action! Alright, what's up everybody? It's Gus. And today I'm here with... Brian. So today we're going to do a little Q&A. We'll be asking each other 10 questions each. And while the other answers... <laughs> Um, so I didn't only do questions, I did questions at Truth or Dares, uh, FMKs, and Would You Rathers. I don't know if he did the same, but let's get right into it. Alright, so let's get started. Alright. <clears throat> Question number one. <laughs> Gus, if you, were a, if you were a girl for one day, what would you do? I think I'd be confused if I was a girl. You know, they're confusing. I wouldn't play with Boo because you know, I already have some. Am I a hot girl or not? Uh, like a six and a half, seven. Can I just be like Nate? Because if I was if I was a Nate, I'd go around friend zoning people left and right. Oh, but this is just for a day. Yeah, that's all it takes. Yeah. Right. To f up someone's life. Yeah. Question number two. What's the biggest lie you've told without being caught? Biggest lie, dude. Without being caught. Oh my god, I don't think I've ever been caught lying. FMK. Okay. Mag <laughs> Magic Johnson, Usher, or Bill Cosby? Bro, I actually <laughs> did chicks to you. <laughs> well, I'd kill Cosby, first of all. That's no question. Alright, who else? Magic Johnson or Usher? You already Bro, said you'd kill. Already, you, already, you already said you kill Cosby. I'm f regardless. <laughs> so you want AIDS or herpes? That's the real question. I'll marry Magic because I don't have to have sex. And you know, when you get married, you just stop having sex. What's your biggest sexual fear? <sighs> my biggest sexual fear. I think my biggest sexual fear would have to be something accidentally going in my butt and me liking it. But that already happened. Describe your sex life in one word. Non-existent. Very. <clears throat> what? What? <laughs> what? Oh. I was choking. Oh, me too. <laughs> ah, amazing. Truth or dare? Oh. Shit. But aren't these like these last three have been like truths? So dare. I dare you to eat six saltine crackers in one minute without water. Do you have saltine crackers? I think so. Well then go get them. I found some prunes. You have to eat a handful. Don't prunes make you <laughs> You said there? <laughs> a handful, dude. My hand fits all of these. Nah, my hands are small. They fit like two. Alright, eat five of them. What do prunes taste like? Six. Six of them. Six? Yeah. I'll just eat ten. No, I'm just kidding. One. <laughs> Two. Oh. What am I at? Four? Uh huh. <coughs> <One>. <coughs> Three. Three. Four. That looks nasty, dude. Your face looks like you're just about to look. It looks like you're f***ing smelling someone's butt cheeks right now. <laughs> With some little poo finkel matter on their butt cheeks. These taste like they want to be raisins, but like they're... <laughs> like they're trying so hard to be raisins, but they just can't. Here, you take this out. Question number seven? I think so. If you had the chance, would you ever take your ex back? <laughs> When did this chance appear? Like, just right now, magically? Yes. No. What is the most awkward moment you've ever had? One time when I showed up, like, 20 minutes late after my paper was due, and I just, like, I ran into class. Like, I fell asleep, like, at 5 in the morning because I was writing the paper. And then I woke up, like, 20 minutes after class had started. So I didn't even shower or brush my teeth or anything, and I just, like, freaking drove in my car, like, and just went straight to class. Like, I didn't do shit. I literally woke up, put on my shoes. Because, you know, if I didn't turn in that paper, 
I wouldn't have passed the class, and I really needed to pass that class. So I get to class all freaking had the old and like smelling and probably stinky breath, and I just like sat down like in the middle of everyone. Okay, on to the next one. It's the grossest thing you've ever had in your mouth. Huh? A lot of things, dude. Was that ten? My turn. It's your turn to answer questions. Well, it all started when I was five. My uncle used to... Question number one. How old were you when you were born? Wait, that's not right. Where were you born? Mexico. Oh. Wow, dude. Well, you know, Mexico's pretty big. I know. Question number dos. Ahem. How old were you when you had your first girlfriend? <laughs> like first serious girlfriend or just Yee. like first actual girlfriend? Yee. All right, it might be a little surprising, but when I was 17. Number three, what size is your shoe? 11 and a half. Nice. How old were you when you last sh your pants? I think I was like four or five. That was the last time? Yeah, it's because my dad was working on his car in the parking lot. And uh, I had to take a sh but apparently... Like apparently my ass didn't know how to stay shut. And I was running back home. And then my underwear kind of felt a little saggy. And... I just remember getting to the bathroom, pulling my underwear down, and there was like a turd just sitting in my underwear. <laughs> Caressed by yeah, your... Yeah, pretty much. It was like, like tidy It was like a, what are they called? The, the little, the hanging thing that you lay on? The, the hammock? The hammock, there we go, a hammock. It was like a hammock. <laughs> Alright. FMK. Hillary Clinton. <laughs> Rosie O'Donnell. Oh, oh. Or, wait for it, wait for it, Oprah Winfrey. Alright, you know I'm definitely marrying Oprah. Yo. Uh, I'm probably gonna kill Rosie because she's Rosie. Sorry, Rosie. And then, yeah, and then I guess I'll f*** Hillary. Because right. apparently Bill's a freak and she must be a freak, so. True. <laughs> True. Hey, good thinking. <laughs> Alright, number, what is this? I lost count. What is the fastest you've ever ran a mile? I was about to say five minutes, but... Oh, man, that's fast. We're talking about a mile. Truth or dare? Hey. All right, I say truth. How old were you when you first watched a horror movie? A horror movie or a horror movie? A horror movie. I think I was about, like, five but the first time I saw my horror movie, that was when I was like 14. Well, these all have been truth, so you still get dared. I dare you to yell out penis out your door to all the workers. <laughs> oh, you're being serious. Please. <laughs> well, that was interesting. All right. Another FMK, IG model edition. Sorry, Susie. So, we've got Yovana, Ventura, Summer Ray, and Jaylene Ojeda. Well, you know what? I think I'm gonna have to marry Summer Ray because she's got a pretty nice body. I mean, they all have pretty nice bodies, except Jaylene's is fake. So, I think I'm gonna have to kill Jaylene. You're not wrong. And then I'll have to f Yovana. Now, would you rather walk around a full day naked or smelling like sh And I mean like sh Like really nasty sh Like you walk around smelling like a farm. <sighs> would I rather be naked or smell like sh Can I be both? No, you have to pick one. I think I'd rather pick naked. Might as well, you know, wiggle it around. Anything and else? last but not least, if you could only eat one food 
for the rest of your life. Susie. Well, I think that's gonna wrap up this video. Thank you guys for watching. Remember, new videos bi-weekly. Wait, bi-weekly means every two weeks. New videos twice a week. Mondays, I know it's Tuesday, but Mondays on this channel, Trust Gus. And then Fridays on the other channel, Just Cuz, with my cousin. Like and subscribe. Oh, and share the video if you like it. Even if you didn't like it, share it. Other people might like it, you never know.